listen, everyone has a different level of their need for affection, but being verbally affectionate, calling each other sweet names. When you express affection in your relationship, what is it instill in the other person? It makes us feel wanted. My husband and I go out of our way to say, hey, you look amazing, or I love that, because I value him, truly, and I feel that affection. But so much of that has to do with the fact that when times get tough and have gotten tough in our marriage in 25 years, of course, you have rough times. You can have really difficult conversations, but you can approach them with love. Every time Vic and I have a conversation about anything, both of us are so well aware that we are both a stand for the marriage, meaning it would be easier not to have a hard conversation, but that is not what is best for the union. So we have hard conversations because we love each other and we want to stay that feeling of being in love and committed and interested and excited by each other. And that means you can't sweep the hard stuff under the rug because that's where resentment starts to build. 